The world of heavy metal experienced a profound loss on December 13th, 2017, with the untimely passing of War Old Dane. This legendary vocalist, known for his tenure with bands like Sanctuary and Nevermore, met an untimely end due to a heart attack while in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Dane's journey was a tumultuous one, fraught with personal challenges. His battle with addiction and health issues, particularly diabetes, were well known within the metal community. Guitarist Johnny Morais, who was part of Dane's solo band, spoke candidly about the toll these struggles took on Dane's health. Yet, despite these obstacles, Dane's voice remained a powerful force in heavy metal, his unique vocal style making him an unforgettable figure within the genre. The news of Dane's passing sent shockwaves through the metal community. Friends, bandmates, and fans alike mourned the loss of a man who had not only contributed significantly to the genre, but had also touched many lives with his music. Sanctuary guitarist Lenny Rutledge took to social media to express his grief, remembering Dane as a friend, a brother, and a musical companion for over three decades. Nevermore, a band known for its unique blend of progressive and power metal, had its own share of struggles. Dane once referred to Nevermore as the greatest band that alcohol ever ruined. Despite the personal differences that led to the band's disbandment in 2011, Dane's former bandmates, Jeff Loomis and Van Williams, expressed their sorrow at his passing through heartfelt social media posts. The loss of Oral Dane was indeed a tragic blow to the world of heavy metal. His struggles, his talent, and his passion for music made him a figure of admiration and respect within the community. Despite his untimely passing, his legacy continues to live on through his music, inspiring musicians and fans alike. Warl Dane, a legend in his own right, left a void that could never be filled. His memory, however, will forever echo in the soaring vocals and powerful lyrics he gifted the world of heavy metal. At the time of his passing, Dane was in the midst of creating his second solo album. The tracks were laid down, the melodies honed, and Dane's signature vocals were beginning to breathe life into the compositions. But fate had other plans, leaving the album in a state of limbo. The question on everyone's lips now is, will this unfinished symphony ever be completed? The band members, left to grapple with the loss of their frontmen, have expressed intentions to finish the album. They're considering inviting guest vocalists to pay homage to Dane, to lend their voices to his unfinished work. Imagine it, each track a tribute, each note a nod to Dane's musical mastery. It's a poignant thought, isn't it? The album, if completed, would stand as a testament to Dane's enduring influence and dedication to his craft. Dane's death had a profound impact on the bands that had shaped his career, Sanctuary, and Nevermore. Sanctuary's guitarist, Lenny Rutledge, took to Facebook to share his grief, remembering Dane as a friend, a brother, and a musical companion for over three decades. His heartfelt post echoed the sentiments of many in the metal world, revealing just how deeply Dane's loss was felt. Nevermore, a band renowned for its unique blend of progressive and power metal, had faced its own challenges even before Dane's death. The band disbanded in 2011, a decision influenced by a myriad of personal differences and struggles. Dane once referred to Nevermore as the greatest band that alcohol ever ruined. It's a stark reminder of the struggles that often lie behind the scenes of the music we love. However, despite the band's breakup and the personal issues that led to it, Dane remained on relatively good terms with his former bandmates. This was evident from the social media posts by Jeff Loomis and Van Williams, both of whom remembered Dane fondly. Their tributes to Dane, filled with respect and admiration, are a testament to his impact as a musician and a friend. The challenges faced by Sanctuary and Nevermore in the wake of Dane's death were significant. The loss of a lead singer is a blow that many bands struggle to recover from. Yet, the determination of these bands to honor Dane's legacy in their music is a testament to his enduring influence. In the end, the bands that Warl Dane helped shape continue to navigate the challenges of his loss creating music that honors his memory. The respect and admiration for Dane from his former bandmates, despite the personal differences and challenges, is evident. They remember him not just as a bandmate, but as a friend and a brother. And while his loss is deeply felt, his influence lives on in the music of Sanctuary and Nevermore, a fitting tribute to a true heavy metal legend. Warl Dane was not just a singer, but a force of nature that left an indelible mark on the heavy metal genre. His journey was marked by his unique vocal style, his lyrical genius, and his undeniable presence on stage. He was more than a musician. He was a storyteller, a poet of the heavy metal world. Worrell's voice was a potent instrument, capable of conveying a range of emotions from despair to anger to hope. 
His operatic tones and high-pitched screams became the signature sound of Sanctuary and Nevermore, inspiring countless others to follow in his footsteps. His vocal dynamism set him apart, captivating audiences worldwide and cementing his place as a heavy metal icon. Beyond his voice, Worrell was also known for his profound and often dark lyrics. He had the ability to articulate complex emotions and weave them into compelling narratives, giving depth and meaning to every song he sang. His lyrics often dealt with personal struggles, societal issues, and existential questions, resonating deeply with his listeners. But Worrell's influence extends beyond his music. His resilience in the face of adversity, his dedication to his craft, and his commitment to authenticity continue to inspire musicians and fans alike. He showed us that music could be a form of catharsis, a way to confront our demons and find solace in the midst of chaos. He used his platform to shed light on mental health issues, addiction, and the human condition, challenging the stereotypes often associated with heavy metal. As we remember Worrell Dane, we honor his talent, his journey, and the powerful legacy he left behind in the world of heavy metal. His music continues to echo through the halls of metal history, reminding us of his indomitable spirit and his unwavering passion for his art. His life may have been cut short, but his influence will continue to reverberate for generations to come. In the words of Worrell himself, in memory we linger on every note of every song. And so, we will continue to remember and celebrate the life and legacy of Worrell Dane, a true heavy metal legend.